What's up, amazing, beautiful people? Your boy, a little cash. We are here. Hey, yo, I am back with my favorite YouTuber. He's my favorite. I love him. I love his videos. I love everything about him. Nukes Top 5. Yo. Spooky Saturday. I'll be reacting to 10 scary videos to creep you out. Can't wait. Y'all new here. I know what you had to do. We're so close to 20k subscribers. Just smash that and let's get started. Go. Nukes top five. He was busy working in his office one day when his son came running in and seemed very wow. upset. The boy claimed that, quote, a man was moving things in the other room. The dad follows the boy into the living room to find things scattered all across the floor. So he checks his security I cam to see just what happened. What he finds chills him to his core. Yo, yo, man, I'm really getting the goosebumps. This is scary. What's he doing? Whoa. Wow, the little boy. It's like they both are fighting, you know? Or they are playing. Playing with the devil. It's like someone pushed him. A small toy in a dog bed can be seen sliding across the living room floor. That's scary. All by themselves. The seemingly annoyed little boy rushes over to the objects and even starts picking up the dog bed and throwing it back to the floor in frustration. The dog bed then aggressively slides back towards him, knocking him over. But luckily, the little boy lands right on the soft bed. Yeah. So, just what was the boy seeing when he told his dad that, quote, a man was moving things? Could some dark presence be haunting their home? You decide. I think little boys can see Glitches these, in the you know, spirits. TikTok user Eddie Glitch. is parked in front of a Boston pizza restaurant in Fresno, California when he spots something very weird. Okay, where is this car that's reflecting on this Boston pizza window? It's a Corvette C8. I seriously don't see that car anywhere. Where's that car? What? Where? Where is that car? Maybe that's just the design of the glass. I don't know. Oh, where's that car? Where is this car? In the reflection of the restaurant's window, Eddie sees an orange Corvette C8. But when he looks around the parking lot, it's not there. In disbelief, Eddie posts this video to TikTok, wondering if he might have caught a quote glitch in the matrix. The bizarre footage goes viral, receiving over 2.8 million views. In the comments, viewers repeatedly ask Eddie to go back and film the location one more time. Okay, we are back at the same parking lot. Because one of the many comments you guys were saying is, Yeah. Go walk up to it. Uh, the car is either inside of the pizza parlor. Yeah. It's a wrap on the window. I don't know. Let's check it out. Yeah, I was thinking the same. Maybe it's a wrap on the... It was a wrap on the window, it, but actually, it's not. This point of view... The reflections look kind of accurate. <sighs> there's a this place, there's a white car reflecting, that's right here. And no, there's like no car in there. This time the shop window accurately reflects <gasps> what's right in front. How come is it possible? The orange Corvette is no longer there. Cut to another video of a supposed quote glitch in the matrix. 
Late one okay. night in Nashville, Tennessee, a woman's friends tell her to quickly grab her camera and hurry outside to check out some very bizarre activity going on in the night sky. Whoa. It's in April 2024. They're breathing heavily. Whoa! <laughs> We're gonna land on the moon! Wow! What? What? What was that? Lightning! You guys! <laughs> I got that! I got that! A group of friends watch in shock as the moon seems to change colors from green to red. What? And then the seems to just discharge some kind of what? electricity. Why did NASA talk about it? Shocking event. Believe that they witnessed everything from a possible government cover-up, aliens, and of course, maybe even a glitch in the Matrix. But Why didn't Elon glitch, tweet it? Aliens are maybe just a really good fake. I leave that up to you to decide. It's like a Follow scene from a movie. Back in 2015, Candace Gardner and her husband attended a Halloween party at an abandoned and allegedly haunted prison. Wow, I don't want to go there. It was a huge mistake. Candace says that the entire night at the party, she felt like something was watching her. And ever since that night, strange things have been happening in Candace's home. That scares she me. That a malicious entity might have followed her home from the old prison. That's scary. A dark spirit that intends oh to harm her and her family. Whoa, 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 Soon whoa, after whoa, the prison whoa. trip, Candace begins to experience unexplained activity in her home. Lights flicker on and off at night while Candace and her husband sleep. Doors in the house open and close on their own. But scariest of all, whoa. the spirit begins to aggressively I got a goosebump. Damn. Candace. Frightening incidents continue to escalate wow. as it seems that the entity wants to seriously hurt Candace. Whoa, that was a knife? Yeah, that's a knife. While Candace is sleeping, she starts to wake up to painful, violent attacks as if some unseen force is roughly grabbing or pulling at her. And she says she caught proof. So late one night, Candace and her husband fall asleep while watching TV on the couch. As the couple sleeps, a CCTV camera in the room captures something absolutely horrifying. Holy shit. No. Was his dog? Something grab my leg! Billy! Ah! It hurts her. She's still feeling the pain. I think this ghost is so aggressive, you know? Or oh, whatever. This leg appears to get grabbed and twisted painfully into the air by an invisible force. She wakes up in a panic and screams for her husband to help her. But all he can do is grab her leg and pull it back. Eventually, he manages to free Candace's legs from whatever is pulling on it. But poor Candace is left sobbing in pain and fear. Now, I have to say that after watching this footage and hearing Candace's desperate pleas for help, this video is very compelling. But do you believe that a dark entity followed Candace home from the prison and is now violently haunting her home? Let me know what you think. 
As for Candace, she says that her family still experiences terrifying paranormal events. And to that this day. spirit is she is a gangster, a gangster videos. spirit. So if you've seen one or you have one, send it our way at nukestop5 at gmail.com. He goes, that's or getting my water. mama. Hello, high water. Whoa, that's. Back in That's August 2021, an unexpected flash flood swept through downtown Omaha, Nebraska. At around 10 p.m., Tony Liu and his two friends are relaxing in his apartment and watching the weather reports about the flood. They decide to take the elevator down to have a look at the flooded city streets for themselves. Mm. It was a very bad idea. Let me see your best moose impression. What the heaven? Tony and his friends didn't realize, but the lower levels of the apartment building were completely flooded with disgusting sewer water. As the elevator reaches the lobby, water pours inside. Wow. The elevator to malfunction and trap them inside with the rising water. Once it got towards kind of my neck, chest, that's when I kind of, okay, like, I could possibly die in here. The water continues Why to wasn't someone in there? The elevator to the point that the three friends can barely keep their head above water. Tony is panicked and makes an emergency phone call to his roommate, Dalen Stapp. And the roommate hurries downstairs to try to help his trapped friends. I told him, hey, uh, I'm, I'm gonna die in here if you guys don't come and try to do something. We went down into about shoulder deep water and just tried pulling it apart with everything we could. We had to get him out or it could have been fatal. Tony's roommate, Dalen, finally manages to pry open the flooded elevator doors to free his friends from what could have been their watery grave. Luckily, they all escape and swim to safety without so much as a scratch. Man, that was dangerous. Surprisingly, Tony Liu says that this was the scariest thing that has ever happened to him. How scary was this? Honestly, I would say this is number one, the most scariest thing in my life. Yeah. Yeah. It's like he was so Damn close down. to to, okay. to death. They okay. both. Then I mean, they all the three. Watson. The Rainbow Fountain and Grill in Carrollton, Texas was built back in 1924. Watson. And before it became the popular local soda shop that it is today, it was home to a pharmacy and a medical office. One of the doctors who frequently worked out of the building was Dr. Robert Blackburn, who was famously known for bringing his cute little dog Watson along with him everywhere wow. into patients' houses. It is said that Dr. Blackburn's loyal little dog Watson still haunts the building to this day. Over the years, workers and customers at the cafe claim to have had strange, unexplained experiences with the ghost of Watson the dog, saying that they could actually feel the spirit of the little dog jump right up on their legs. Since the restaurant added security cameras, they have started to capture some of these strange encounters on video. Take a look. Okay. What are they doing? They're checking it. No, it's like someone grabbed their leg. Same thing. Someone is grabbing their legs, yeah? And no one is there. That's weird. CCTV footage shows employees and visitors getting nipped at the ankles or even scratched by something that they can't see. Now with so many people experiencing the exact same phenomena, and with all of it caught on camera, it makes you wonder whether the spirit of little Watson the dog is still hanging around the old soda shop, scaring the patrons, but perhaps only trying to find new friends to play with. A friend. In a flash. <laughs> Sometimes a very silly moment turns scary in an instant. Two guys are just goofing around, but then like a bolt out of the blue, fun time is over. A 
sudden, very close lightning strike rips through the clouds and scares the Okay. Sending them running inside in Yo, that guy! Yo, he was like, no, let me in first! <laughs> I think the door was jammed. Didn't see it. Okay. Axolosa frequently explores caves and tunnels in the woods of Colomos, Mexico. After yeah. finding what seems like evidence of witchcraft in one of those caves, Axel believes that some dark entity attached itself to him and now follows him wherever he goes. One day, in the strangest place, a public restroom, Axel starts to hear bizarre sounds. He takes out his phone and hits record. And what happens next is like something right out of a nightmare. Wow. Donde quiero que ven? Estoy ahorita en el baño de la universidad. Pero lo peor ahorita es que estuve, bueno, acabo de terminar de hacer el baño. Pues estaba todo normal. Okay. Pero ahorita están ruidos raros y se está tocando la puerta. Pero quiero que vean que pues no hay nada. Vean, ahí está mi reflejo. Un reflejo, pero vean de este lado, pues aquí no hay nada. Aquí tampoco hay nada. Acá el lugar es bastante pequeño y está mi reflejo. Espera, voy. Escuchar. I can't stand there, honestly. Axel hears a strange slamming sound from one of the bathroom stalls. I would just run. There's no one else in the restroom. But did you see it? A face can be seen peeking know. through the small crack in the bathroom stall Whoa. door. But when Axel looks over the top, there's no one there. Axel is completely... Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. In fact, oh, oh my. he doesn't even notice until he posts this video online. I didn't and notice. Come flooding in. People tell Axel, uh, hey, there was a face looking out. But Axel says he didn't see it. Hello, doggy. It's a little before six in the morning when a Reddit user's dog who's home alone experiences... I'm home alone too. Whoa. Maybe. Oh my god. It's like he's scared. The camera captures the sound of an unexplained voice whispering, Hello, which seems to send the dog right into a panic. The owner says that absolutely no one other than the dog was home at the time of this recording. He also says that he's never experienced anything like this in his house. And he wonders if he captured something paranormal. But what do you think this voice is? This voice is straight from the hell. Mirror, mirror. The guy named beautiful. Edgar from Colima, Mexico says that his four-year-old niece was given a very strange old toy. A pink mirror that lights up, plays music, I and features really, a pre-recorded really voice that says cute little phrases. Toys. Mm, nothing too odd there. But over the next few weeks, Edgar starts to notice his niece talking to the mirror daily. No. Some of the toy's responses are eerily intelligent, almost as if it can hear and respond to the little girl. Edgar and the girl's mom decide to ask some questions themselves. What happens next is truly disturbing. That looks cool. Hola. 
soy Jessie, la princesa más bella del castillo de los sueños del espejo mágico. ¡Qué tierna eres! Nosotras seremos mejores amigas. ¿Tu personaje favorito? Si papá pregunta, mi favorito es mi papi. Si mamá pregunta, yo responderé que la que más me gusta es mi mamá. smart. Y si tú me preguntas, te diré que la que más me gusta eres tú. Soy una niña muy inteligente. <laughs> The mirror says that its name is Jesse and it gives oddly specific answers to the mother's questions. Well, Edgar and the girl's mom are a little freaked out. They remove the batteries from the toy and store it in the barn behind the house. Years pass, and the family forgets all about the toy, until they start to hear a strange little voice coming from the barn in the middle of the night. Edgar says that the voice sounded just like the mirror toy, and was saying things like, come play with me, followed by a sinister little giggle. <laughs> he posted his video and story to TikTok, and things got even weirder. Because you see, some viewers commented that they had the exact same mirror toy, but they said that their mirror didn't talk at all. Viewers urged Edgar to make one more video with the strange toy. He's reluctant, but eventually he searches out the mirror in the family's barn, and this happens. Yo, that's... Para los que me estuvieron pidiendo que buscara el espejo y le pusiera baterías, aquí está. Solo pude encontrar estas piezas y pues sí, le puse unas baterías que tenía aquí en la casa. Como ven, son nuevas. La neta no creo que prenda, pero bueno, vamos a calarle. Muy miedo. Wow. Hola. Hola, encantado de conocerte. <ríe> Gracias, amigo. Me da gusto. <ríe> Eres muy divertido. ¿Tienes una fiesta? Mm, no, no tengo fiesta. ¿Tú tienes? No sé. Cuando me levanté, te vi a ti. Ay, vas a chingar a tu madre. Edgar says that at this point he's just done with the mirror. He says he threw it out with the trash. So could a Why? entity be attached to this toy? Let me know what you think. Oh, wait, I don't know. It was more like an, you know, Alexa. Or says he stores all <laughs> yeah. his collectibles in a local storage unit. But lately, things have gotten a little strange. With weird answers. He says that he started to get odd complaints from the staff at the storage facility. They said that they heard bizarre loud noises coming from inside his storage unit at all hours of the day and night. The antique collector is very confused at what the noises could be and sets up a security camera inside the unit to see what could be going on. When he reviews the footage the next day, he is shocked. I think his hand moved. Yo! Whoa! Looking at me. An old antique monkey doll that he recently purchased inexplicably sits up and just moves around on its own. Then it drops right back down, motionless. After witnessing this creepy incident, the antique collector says that he believes that the old doll might be cursed or have a paranormal entity attached to it. Yeah. So is this footage real or? Is it all just an elaborate hoax? I'm for this black. As always, you decide. Yeah, for the black Thanks magic. For Be sure to subscribe so that you never miss a video. Oh yeah. Maybe even visit me over on social media, at Twitter and Instagram and TikTok, and even on the Reddit. And you can even add a creative post of your own, like this guy. To wash the baby's hair. <laughs> بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم أعوذ من الشيطان الرجيم سيستر something inside your baby hopefully we'll see you back here next time yo that was great yo link to the original video it would be in the description you can check it out from there I really enjoyed it and if you have any scary spooky video 
to send it to me. I would love to watch that. And that's it, guys. I hope you like it, share it, and until next time, bye bye.